happening. Go going missing okay. for coming. Yeah. yeah. at 80 degrees at the top and this material as it enters this tube will be at a thousand degrees centigrade so there is enough heat exchange it is in the tube that now we burn inside the, inside the, tube. Inside the tube is where now we it's a big tube <laughs> it's a big one so this is the uh, fossil coal that we are putting in to ignite and form that flame. Oh. Yes. So the, the through here. Through here. Okay. So the clinkering temperature is about 1500 degrees centigrade. It is unimaginable. But as the clinker comes out of the tube, it is at around 1100 because there is a bit of cooling in the tube. Now in the cooler, it is entering at 1100. And as it goes out, it is at 70 maximum degree centigrade. 70 degrees centigrade. Yes. So there is a lot of heat exchange because we are pumping in cold air from the atmosphere. The heat, what do you do? Yes. Uh, this cold heat, that uh, air that we are pumping in, takes off the hot air, and this hot air is taken for uh, waste heat recovery, okay. which we will later use for Generative power generation. Here what we are sustaining is uh, power, mm. so the grid power has to be stable. Mm. And then I think I would like to thank the chairman. You can see the investment in environmental dust collectors. So, additives of which I know due to the strength there is clay and uh, there is bauxite so after that we and all that you get it from around yeah we get from around okay. yeah then from there to Naika kwa the tallest story there ile aincha naitwa silo yeah to Naika kwa silo and then uh, in it blending silo now so he in your blending silo mm -hmm. then uh, we come to the pyro section mm -hmm. whereby ile mnara mrefu mayona inaitwa preheater so we preheat uh, we preheat the material to a thousand degrees so i know you are wondering tuna preheat na nini tunatumia maka the call from uh, tanzania inaitwa anthracite call yeah so you bring the 